but we're in the people business. And that's what we were trying to do is touch people's lives. Um, I started reflecting on how I was raised. And, uh, you know, I'm from a small town in Arkansas, Lone Oak, Arkansas. And uh, we were a farming community. We were farmers. My family still farms today. And I started reflecting on how I was raised. You know, I had, had a mother and a father, Christian home, sister, um, had aunts and uncles, cousins. And we were, we were a community. As I went on into college, I still had mentors in my life through college as I started my career. Had people who looked after me and helped me and just kind of lead and guide and directed me. And at that moment on the board, that's when I realized, I'm like, that's what we're doing for these kids. It's like we're working with these kids who may come from a single home, who may be raised by grandparents. Uh, they don't have that support structure, that community. And you know that's what we were trying to provide at the Boys and Girls Club with after school programs and just trying to provide some stability in kids' lives. You know, I see that with the Mentoring Alliance by bringing on Gospel Village and uh, Boys and Girls Club after school program, the, the uh, Rose City Summer Camps. You know, we, we used to always just have kids come to us, but then what we realized by going into the schools that we can bring after school programs to the kids. We can put people into their lives by going to them, not waiting for people to come to us. And then by bringing on Gospel Village, we were able to touch more lives. I mean, a lot of times we have these kids through sixth grade, but then by having Gospel Village on board is that that's another extension of the Boys and Girls Club where you see a special need. A, uh, a kid may have a special need. A parent would like you know, more mentoring. Maybe there's not a father around. And this is where Gospel Village can bring and inject that, that something special into that kid's life and just showing God's love. Most people aren't looking for handouts. You know, they're looking for a hand up. And I think that's what we are providing is we're giving some stability, um, showing God's love, just showing them that someone cares about them. You feel a great sense of, of a joy that your impact, you're doing something. It's making a difference in people's lives. And that to me is very, very important. I mean, that, that you see God's love right there.